Hello, Dan Richardson here again at the Chapel of the North Hills, and we're continuing our study of Jesus last week. And today we get to this story in recorded all in a couple of places. I'm going to be looking at it in Mark, the 14th chapter, where Jesus is anointed. He is in Bethany, and while he is having dinner there in Bethany, a woman comes in, an unnamed woman comes in with an alabaster jar of expensive perfume, pure nard, it says, she broke the jar and poured it on his head. And this was quite a shock to some people. And some were wondering why she would waste, so to speak, that expensive thing. Um, an alabaster jar, very expensive. And very likely this expensive perfume in this, ex this expensive uh, container would have been her most prized possession, something that was usually kept for like a dowry for a wedding, perhaps. This would be almost akin to a life savings for a young girl, as she would uh, want to start off her life, something that would would be very costly and very, uh, very treasured. And this is what she broke and poured on Jesus' head to anoint Jesus. And they were thinking, well, they, she could have sold that and given it to the poor. You know, sounding very pious, I'm sure. Um, of course, one of those would have been Judas. And we're told that he liked thinking that away because he was the one that was keeping the money. And he would kind of pocket some of that money that was the group's purse. Well, Jesus said, leave her alone. Don't bother her. She's done a noble thing. Because bottom line, no matter how expensive it is, no matter how costly it is, anything given to Jesus is never wasted. Giving it to Jesus is the best use of any resource we have. And it's never going to be wasted. He said, wherever the gospel is proclaimed, what she has done will also be told in memory of her. We're told right after this, Judas made a deal with the priests on how to betray Jesus. So he was in it for the money right even till then. And money was, uh, he was lured in by money so he would betray Jesus. And this woman gave all that she had, gave this very expensive thing in order to anoint Jesus. Gifts to Jesus are never wasted. Be blessed.